and that's Let's a goal for from Parthak. Uh, that was a well taken goal from Parthak. That was, so that was a very good pass very good on the lead up. A nice little one two. Floats it in. Plus half and Sharp. I don't think Sharp had any chance there. Your tricky wingers. They can come on and feel like McMullen's got bags of pace on them. Even Zark Grodden offers you something different, which. Oh, it's a really oh, oh. good clearance and it falls in. It's 2 0 for Thistle. 2 0 for Thistle. That was an absolute gift to Patrick Thistle and they've taken it with both hands. Milne looks to take the throne for Thistle, plays it into Lawless. Brian Graham's through here. Good play across in. And that's and three, three nil Fissel. Fissel. A well worked goal there from Fissel and, and very well worked goal. You can't take anything away from them there. Uh, it was a lovely bit of play. Brian Graham done well to get the cross in. Dundee defence has caught in all types of trouble. Nobody else. The header there. Right the there. Goal. It's three one of our own, Kami Kerr. That was an excellent corner in. Kami Kerr makes the run. At the far, uh, near post, headers in. Well, one from McMullen, swung in. Ball in. Get a head up. And oh, it's a yes, it's two. three two. And it's French just scores it. Great it's head up. I just sneaked down at the back post there. On with. Five minutes to play, Dundee are right back in this game. Again, bounce was all.
Can't let him shoot, they do, and it's 1 0 to Edinburgh. Robertson, the scorer. And after all the Kelty pressure, Robertson's first shot targets the goal. No real pressure from Edinburgh set up until that point. But he does, he gets the turn just a step, step beyond, and a clean shot of goal. And then Murray. Robertson now. Sean Lane to Robertson. Goes down. Penalty given. Robertson steps up. And it's saved by David Jameson. Robertson goes low right. Jameson dives low right and he gets a touch and he's able to scoop it up. It's still 1 0 here in New Central. Only to Shanley. See Forster switched off. Is he see? Two and out in, but Kid and really well. I thought, why are you doing? It's Paul Woods as well. Eh? Charlie Barnes sleeping a wee bit there, and Paul Woods maybe just a wee bit. Oh, and it's, it's a penalty for Stenrar. And the boy knows that, I think. It was a penalty. Eh, Nate. No disagreement from the players. It's a penalty Stenrar. Scott Hooper was the offender, and he knows that he was a mile late. And it's Paul Woods who'll take it. What a chance for the Blues to open their scoring for the for season 22-23. This is a vital penalty for Stenrar. Now Paul Woods, what a chance for Stenrar to, to open the scoring here. And he does, without any doubt. And it's Stenrar 1, an athletic nil. And it's Paul Woods from the spot. Absolutely no doubt. They've played really well, first 20, 25 minutes, and they get the rewards, 1-0 to the Blues. I mean, the penalty was a penalty all day long, and uh, the boy knew it right away. He would say, now, Sonrar have got to really 
What's this? Oh, the referee gives a foul again, yeah. Uh, so now really got to dig in here. Next 10, 5, 10 minutes. Just hold on to this one goal advantage. That's George Gully with the. Oh! And it's well cleared by Gavin, but it's a, a bit a bit of escape. Let's see, Eden Smith is going to take it eventually. Could be a long throw in this and two loops and up just go for it. For the season. Superb bit of play there. As Matty Yates knocks the ball for Craig Brayson. Reflects it on through for Tamar. Tamar. <laughs> Just to confirm there, Tamar with the goal, not Matty Yates. Matty Yates flicked on to Brayson. Five pick it up. It's with Walls. Chance to run, plays it inside to Shivoni. Inside again to Walls, plays it inside. Shepard is there, he's turned into the net. 
Scott Shepard at the edge of the six yard box has made it 1 0 to East Fife. Good break down the right there by Brogan Walls. Crossed during pre season and earned himself a two year contract. Bolzanski's there, but he's beaten to it by Shepard. Shepard, he flicks over the top, and it's into the net. A disaster for Elgin City. A real mix up there between Dolzanski and Daniel Hoban. And Shepard was alert to that, nipped in and just flicked it over the top of Hoban and trundles into the net and it's 2 0 he's fine. A little note to the, the number four. Not quite sure what he's meant to do with the note once he's finished. Maybe he's meant to eat it. Anyway, here we go, Connor, that's a low one, but Scott Mercer running in there and it's in Scott Mercer! Great run by the fullback, got in front of them and he's fired that into the net to give East Fife a 3 0 lead. It's a disaster for Elgin. There's a cry of come on, Elgin roars out from the stand. Connor comes in, Fleming misses it, Darren McCartney's got the header, he's got one back for Elgin City. 10 minutes, 15 minutes to go, sorry, here at Borough Briggs. It's Elgin City 1, East Fife 3. So Elgin have their first goal of the season but there's still a mountain to climb.